I've got my first ring out here. It's a very pretty ring. It's ringing up like a 55. That's, that's gold. But my eyes are too bad to see any type of uh, markings in it right now. It looks like it's kind of diamond. Teardrop diamond with a halo around it. everybody it's on Tuesday about 7 45 headed out to the lakes gonna get a little early start today uh, went out to a couple of lakes uh, last week uh, and just I couldn't even get in them they were just so crowded I hit them late and kind of ate late in the afternoon and so I'm gonna try to go out and hit three lakes kind of my area in a row boom 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 and see what I'm come up with today and then on Friday on my day off I'm gonna venture out to uh, a couple of hour drive away from me, hit a couple of lakes I haven't hit already. And uh, but a lot of times on lake, you hit you hit them, and you'll find a lot of stuff. And sometimes you'll hit the same lake, and you won't find a single thing. And I've done both already this year, just in the two weeks I've been water detecting. So I'm going to go back over these lakes that you've seen me in the videos in the last two uh, weeks on, and uh, see what we come up with. I've hit them and, and come up with nothing, and then I hit them again a couple of days later and come up with three or four rings. So it's all about timing. Sometimes it's just getting out there before anybody else gets out there. And uh, so we'll just see, we're gonna have fun with it. Uh, I'm gonna spend today lake hunting and uh, spend the day on Friday. And get a total of about uh, six different lakes and about nine different swim areas. Maybe eight lakes, I'm not sure. Uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight lakes. I'm gonna hit eight lakes and uh, we're gonna hit six, seven, eight, uh, eight different swim areas and so uh, we'll see what we come up with but anyway I've got a little drive ahead of me y'all just sit back and relax and I'll see you when I get out in the water I made it out to the lake lake number one for today uh, there's nobody here it's awful calm and quiet I know there's been sightings of an alligator up on the beach so that kind of concerns me being my only one out here uh, I just got to keep my head on a swivel you guys never see me, that's what happened. I got eaten up by an alligator. All right, let's get in the water, see what we come up with. second and third target was an ear ring and a toe ring so maybe it hasn't been hunted out here so we got the ear ring we got the toe ring now let's get a ring all right let's keep that it's a nice little necklace there. It's got a little, like a little garnet stone in it with little diamond chips. It's got writing on the back. I can't make it out, but it may say 925 on it. All right, let's keep on going. Now, I don't think this lake has been hunted. I'm digging a lot of pull tabs and a lot of earrings and uh, necklaces, so let's go for the gold ring or the big men's ring. That's what we're going for today, so let's keep at it. Well, that 
that's like one down. Uh, no rings, finger rings, but I did get a toe ring and a bunch of earrings. So we're gonna move on down to lake number two. I'll see you out in the water. Well, I'm at lake number two. I just came out. I've been here for about uh, about an hour. I got three pull tabs and a quarter. So it's definitely been hit. So we're going to lake three now. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna add one more lake. I'm gonna go to it right now then, and uh, do four lakes today. So let's get the lake. All right, we're at lake number three. And I've got the earrings and the toe ring. Now I need a finger ring. And I was here on my last video, but uh, I didn't come and hunt this one particular area. Uh, there's too many people down here, so I'm going to hunt this area. Maybe a couple more spots. I didn't really do good the other day. Uh, cover it very well. And then we're going to head home and get one more lake to go. So let's jump in and see what we get. finger ring. Got the earrings, the toe ring, and I don't know, I can't see a marking on it. It's ringing up like an 80, but it looks rose gold or copper. If that's rose gold, that's a big diamond. That's going to be good. If that's just going to be copper, it's just going to be a fake diamond. But hey, we got a good one. Check that out. All right, ring number one. This is lake number four. All right, my last lake for the day. I was just fixing to give up, but I'm going to search a little bit more now. Let's keep going. All right, here's lake number five. Let's go see what we can get on this one. All right, this is lake number six. And uh, I've got one more lake I'm going to do later on this evening. Uh, actually, two more lakes. Uh, so it'll be six, seven, and eight. And so hopefully we'll get something. And so it looks good. I'm the only one out here. So let's get in the water, see what we come up with. Seven. It's going to be a toe ring, like a copper toe ring. I got one toe ring at that first lake I went to a while back, and here's my second toe ring. And uh, all right, at least it's something. I haven't found nothing but a token, and uh, this so far and some change uh, may call it a day and go on to the next lake. So we'll see. I'll hunt here at least a little bit longer since I got this. Okay, let's keep on going. <laughs> definitely a toe ring trip. This is a silver. Rang up like a 57. The reason why is because it's broken. It's not a solid loop and so this silver is ringing lower. But uh, yeah, another toe ring. That's number three on this trip. So uh, I got earrings and toe rings and now I just need to get those finger rings. Let's keep on going. First ring out here. It's a very pretty ring. It's ringing up like a 55. That's that's gold. But my eyes are too bad to see any type of uh, markings in it right now. It looks like it's got a diamond, teardrop diamond with a halo around it. Uh, I don't know if this is going to be costume or if it's going to be a real gold ring. I'll let you know on the video. I have to look at it. But that's ring number one out here. Ring number two for the trip. So let's keep going.
This is, uh, what is this, my seventh lake. The other lake I was going to, it was uh, closed down due to COVID. So I came out to this lake. It's about a, you know, pretty good drive from my house, but it's on the way. So I decided to stop. I'm glad I did. I just found my second ring. This is a uh, either a tungsten or a tungsten carbide with a, some type of inlay into it. Real pretty. All right, let's keep going. I'm going to search the deep. That's about chest deep water here. So I'm going to start looking deep and see if I can't find any more. All right, let's keep going. Well, I think I found either a stainless, it's ringing up like a 42. I think it's going to be stainless. I can't read it. It could be titanium, but titanium I think rings a little higher. But I'm just real close to where I found that touched and I haven't been five minutes more. So here's ring number four for the trip and three in this swimming area. So gonna work this section a little bit better. All right, let's keep going. Well, I'm out at my eighth lake, and this is going to be my 11th swimming area uh, for this week that I've been out on. And uh, hopefully I can find something out here and uh, get a couple more rings, make a great video for you guys. So uh, let's get to swinging, see what we come up with. been out here about 10, uh, 15 minutes and uh, got a dime and right here I got two quarters and my first ring. It's ringing up like a 41, 42. I think it's going to be a stainless steel skull and crossbones ring. But uh, yeah, got a coin spill in a ring. That's the first one. So that's a good sign. 15 minutes and got my first ring. Let's keep on going. cap and a, a golf tag. There's 11, 11 3, 2016 and Honda on the top. Must be their name. All right, let's keep going. on the second swimming hole so this is going to be I don't know that's nine, nine different swing areas I may get one more on the way home so we'll see let's get in the water see what we can find well nothing there I stayed there about 20 minutes didn't get a single thing but a quarter now I'm headed uh, back to the first lake on this video where I found the first green and I'm gonna hit it because it's just beside my house hit that and then call this week a done week and they'll start making a video for you guys. All right, I'll see you in the water in about an hour. Well, I'm at the eighth, eighth lake. Actually, ninth, if you count it, this is the same lake twice. And so this is actually the eighth lake, but the one I'm doing twice. And this is where I found the first ring. I'm gonna go out there and it's just close by my house. I'm gonna go and I'll give it about an hour and just see if I find, don't find anything I'm gonna call it quits and do my wrap up and start making this video but uh, it's been a good week uh, found a lot of good stuff so let's get in the water see what we can come up with well I got back in from the lake so I didn't stay out there at that last lake the one I did twice uh, I got one earring there and I came on in I'm getting tired 
And but I had a real good week at the lakes. I found a lot of good stuff this week, but you can see I'm just burnt. I'm just tired. I'm ready to go get a bath and get lay down and take a nap. But let me spin you around. And let me show you what I got. All right, this is the, for the week. This is what I got here. There's my aluminum trash, my aluminum caps, bottle caps. There's my beaver tails. There's all the square uh, pull tabs, fishing lures, hair clips, miscellaneous stuff. Got a cool looking rocket. I don't know what that is, but uh, I guess this goes off a water gun or something like that. Really cool. I got three pairs of sunglasses this time around, and uh, those are still good good shape there. And then we got some uh, pugs here. I think this is a pretty nice brand. Found a watch, and look at that. Still working. Still working. Uh, got three of those vape pens. Finding more and more of those. I uh, got a whistle that still works. Some type of token. I don't know what that is. Looks like a kid token. Rang up like a quarter. And then I've got a tag, a dog tag. It says Ishonda on one side and 11-5-2016 on the other. I don't know what that is. Let's see, I got 5, 10, 15, 19 pennies and 4, 8, 12, I mean uh, 8 uh, nickels. And then 5, 10, 15, 18 dimes. And on the quarters, we got 4, 8, 12, 15 quarters and even got a one dollar coin this time around and like i said the name of my video is going to be earrings toe rings and finger rings and here's all the got an ear gauge here i guess that's what that is but uh, a couple of studs and a big heart shape um, got a couple of more little pieces here real nice little piece of necklace and off a charm then I got three toe rings. I got a starfish toe ring. This one here is silver, and this is just going to be copper. So I got three toe rings. And then two real nice rings I thought was going to be really nice, but they're just a copper one on the right and just uh, non-precious metal. The diamonds are not real. I got two uh, stainless steel rings. One is a skull and cross. So I guess the preacher digger did get his cross, but it's just a skull and cross. Uh, pretty nice little. I think that that feels like titanium. It's so light, like a titanium, but I think it's going to be stainless. And then I got this tungsten. That's a real nice tungsten ring, tungsten carbide. So I got five rings in all there, three toe rings, a couple of charm, and it comes off a necklace, and then a bunch of uh, earrings. And so... There we have it, earrings, finger rings, and toe rings, or earrings, toe rings, and finger rings. There we go. There's all the trash, and here's all the treasure. And like I always say, the greatest treasure is not what can be sitting on the back of your tailgate that you find out of a lake. The greatest treasure is what can be found up in heaven. Keep looking up, keep searching. Until we meet again, I just want to say happy hunting, and God bless. Mm -hmm.